Now we are joined with Dr. Andrew Azab. He is the owner and chiropractor at All Family Chiropractic and Injury Clinic. And today we're talking about injuries when it comes to trauma, whether you're in a car accident or other kinds of trauma that you might um, yeah. see. Not so much everyday stuff, right? Right, right. Uh, car accidents, we've had a whole bunch here, especially with the um, weather changing ice, and all, yeah, yeah. all that stuff. Uh, and that can oftentimes result in injuries. Mm -hmm. um, and it doesn't take a whole lot of vehicle damage to cause injuries of the occupant. Right. Um, the threshold for injury, in, in, for example, in a rear end collision, mm -hmm. is eight miles an hour. Wow. Now, keep in mind that our automobile bumpers mm -hmm. are rated for 15 miles an hour. So somebody can okay. hit at 15 miles an hour, have no damage to their vehicle, but they're over the threshold for occupant injury. Um, so you can have very little vehicle uh, mm -hmm. damage, mm -hmm. but the occupant sustained injury. Okay, That's for a rear end sense. collision. So yeah. you can't look at the car and determine nope. what the pain is for nope, you can't. the person who's in And it. also you can have what's called an elastic collision. Okay. If, if the car is not totally stopped, but it's rolling and you get hit from behind, mm -hmm. the car can accelerate. So you get a lot of acceleration, no damage to the car, but the more the acceleration, the more you get whipped back, the more right. the injury. Okay. I didn't realize this, yep. um, and I think a lot of people out there would probably be shocked by that. Yep. If that were to happen, how soon should they get to a chiropractor or go to the doctor? Um, the, uh, the sooner the sooner the better, mm -hmm. because oftentimes symptoms don't start immediately. Okay. They can sometimes be delayed, but we have tests that we can do to detect whether there is an injury or not. Okay. Uh, and some people sometimes go to the emergency room to mm -hmm. begin with, and they say, well, they said there was nothing wrong. Right. Well, when they hear when the when the emergency room doctors tell you there's nothing wrong that means there's nothing fractured there's okay. nothing broken that is an emergency that they have to like you know if you walk to out fix right then and yeah, there. yeah. It, th that means you can be released and go home um, but oftentimes patients can have symptoms mm -hmm. discomfort aching uh, neck pain headaches things of that nature okay. which if not attended to mm -hmm. even though they can go away temporarily sometimes they can go away for years but the trauma and the, and the problem has already been caused, sure. and if it's not treated right then and there, it can yeah. come back years later to haunt them. Makes a lot of sense. Now, I know for some, they may think that they have to have a referral before they actually come to see you. Is that true? No, no, they can come right in to see us. Uh, they can actually, you know, they don't have to necessarily go to the emergency room mm -hmm. first, because we have x-ray facilities where we can examine them, x-ray them, detect if there is a fracture or something of that nature. If that's the case, we refer them elsewhere, but oftentimes there isn't. We can go ahead and treat them and take care of them. Makes sense. Now, where should they contact you? Uh, they can just give us a call at 785-7246 or 785-PAIN, and we're at uh, 4505 82nd Street, um, just uh, west of Quaker on uh, 82nd Street. Perfect. Thank you so much for being here. It's a good topic. Thank you. All right, coming up after the break, Christy Martinez has your Latino Lubbock update. Stay with us.